Hi guys, this is Chooks from Patchwork of Tips. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, some of you have been having issues with my guide on uh, my written guide on how to like blur parts of a picture in Mac OS preview app. So today I decided to like do a video to show you guys how I actually do it for those of you that can't follow the guide which I wrote. Now, what I do, I go to find, um, I go to the location of the image in question. Do please take note of the file size of this image because it's going to change after the modification. Simply open the image in question, select the part of the image which you'd like to delete or blow out, and then hit the delete button and it goes away. And that's that. Simply go to preview, sorry, go to file, save, and then quit preview. If you open the image again, it's blurred out. That section you wanted is already, it's blurred out. Now, the problem with this is, if you look right here, the file size has increased. Previously, the file size was 950 something kilobytes, and now it's 2.9 megabytes. So to reduce the file size, what I do, I use a free app called Image Optim. I simply open the app, drag the image into the app, and wait for a few minutes. What the app basically does is compress the image. And hopefully we should be closer to the previous size or, you know, as much as possible, closer to the image, to the former image size. Sometimes it takes a while, so let's just wait. As it keeps running, the file size tends to decrease and shows you like um, what the final file size is going to be like. And as you can see, it's even below the previous file size that we had. I think we had that 955 before and now it's 942. So we'll just keep waiting. When it's done, it's going to turn green over here. There. There is it. There it is. And uh, we're done. Now if you would go back to the app, sorry, go back to the location of the image, you can see that the file size has reduced back to 943 kilobytes. And when you open it, the image quality still looks the same. And that's how I do it. Now, um, if you're going to download this app, the Image Optim, I'm going to leave the um, the link to the in the description box below. This is what my settings for the app looks like in case you want to set yours up. This is the general section and optimization level section. So that's all there is to it. Hope you guys find, um, find this video helpful. And if you do, do please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Do have a nice day.